Hi there everybody, this is Miss Nelson here. Today we are doing lesson 3.7 in our 4th grade Florida Go Math books. Lesson 3.7 is problem solving and multiplying two digit numbers. So all of the problems that we're going to have for this lesson are going to be word problems and you're going to have to ask yourself these three things in order to solve them. Number one, what do I need to find? Number two, what information do I need to use? And number three, how will I use the information? Or in other words, what kind of math am I going to do? So let's read this together. During the 2010 Great Backyard Bird Count, an average of 42 bald eagles were counted in each of 20 locations throughout Alaska. I'm just going to stop right there and I'm going to underline the important things. 42 each is a multiplication word and 20. So I know I'm going to have one problem of 42 times 20. In 2009, an average of 32 bald eagles were counted in each of 26 locations throughout Alaska. Okay, so the important information in that sentence is 32 each in 26. So another multiplication problem would be 32 times 26. So based on this data, how many more, how many more bald eagles were counted in 2010 than in 2009? So what this last sentence is telling me is that I'm going to have to do how many more means subtraction. I'm going to have to subtract my answer for 2010 from my, sorry, subtract my answer from 2009 from my answer from 2010. So here, let's fill in this chart. What do I need to find? I need to find how many more, how many more bald eagles were counted in 2010 than 2009. What information do I need to use? In 2010, 20 locations counted an average of 42 bald eagles. And in 2009, 26 locations counted an average of 32 bald eagles. All that came from up here, what I underlined. How will I use this information? I can solve simpler problems. Find the number of bald eagles counted in 2010. Find the number of bald eagles counted in 2009. Then draw a bar model to compare the 2010 count to the 2009 count. So first find the total number of bald eagles counted in 2010. I will do that by doing 42 times 20. 42 times 20, I can do my basic fact of 42 times 2. That's 84 and then add my zero. So 840 bald eagles were counted in 2010. Next, find the total number of bald eagles counted in 2009, which I'll do 32 times 26 for that. 32 times 26. So 32 times 26 is 832. You can work that out any way that you want. The traditional way, the partial products, distributive property, any way that you've learned that you like, you can work out 32 times 26. So then last is draw a bar model because I need to subtract. So 840, take away the 832. 840 minus 832. Borrow here, that's an 8, that's a 0, that's a 0. So the answer is there were 8 more bald eagles in 2010 than there were in 2009. So just make sure when you're solving these kind of problems that you're asking yourself, what do I need to find? What information do I need to use and how will I use that information? Or in other words, what kind of math will I do? All right, if you're in my class, I want you to write down in your planner the 
um, secret word is cookies. That will let me know that you have watched this video. And if you have any other questions, just please feel free to leave me a comment. Thanks.